And they have the fans on these steers to keep them cool. But we can see by the sign here, this is a grand champion, 1,271 pounds from Johnsville. And then the other one is 1,273 pounds. It's an Angus, and it's also from Johnsville. When you shear these, do you cut them close to the skin when you take um, the fur? About 10 yeah. how, how far do you cut the fur? Like, no, that's not bad. Like, 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 Down to about maybe 3 eighths of an inch yeah, or so. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. So, and how much will they grow out to before you cut them? Well, I mean that much. Well, that, well it that depends, depends on the outcome. Pack. It's anywhere from, I think it's 4 to 7 inches. Really? So they'll be pretty, pretty thick oh, yeah. by the time yeah. you cut them. Yes. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. You learned something here at the fair. Okay. Well, congratulations on that blue ribbon. And what was this award for again? This was for the public relations. Public class. relations. Wow. Blue ribbon. Congratulations. Thank you. Wait. Let's do it. Get it, Hunter. Alpacas are all li lining up here, getting ready to be judged. Okay, we're still here at the Great Frederick Fair, and I'm here with Kelly. We're at the GOP tent, and can you comment on anything you've seen here as far as people coming in and out, the level of enthusiasm, and what's going on with the McCain-Palin ticket? Well, I can tell you that it's a level of enthusiasm that I have not ever seen here in the Republican tent. It has been so difficult to keep any sort of supplies in. I just brought in about 500 uh, yard signs, and I would say about 300 of them have gone in the past half an hour. People are so excited. They're excited for McCain. They're especially excited for Sarah Palin. And the enthusiasm is something beyond, I think, Frederick County has seen in a very, very long time for the Republicans. Now you said especially Sarah Palin. What comments have you gotten? Uh, well, there, obviously with the Republicans, with the very intense primary that we had with John McCain, there were several Republicans, or lots of Republicans in the area that may have been a little bit more conservative than what they thought John McCain was. Mm -hmm. So by adding Sarah Palin, a very strong conservative, to the ticket, it has really inspired that part of the party that was maybe a little bit lacking enthusiasm of, for McCain himself. And what's your impression of Palin? I think Sarah Palin's wonderful. I'm one of her biggest fans. I think she's a pit bull with lipstick, and I have a button that I got made up in Minnesota at convention, and um, I consider myself a pit bull with lipstick just like Sarah. And turn her loose in Washington, D.C., right? Go get them. <laughs> all right. Thanks for all your service. Thank you. Has this, has this one competed yet? Yes, he has earlier today. But not in this competition, right? No. And now, how do you prepare the animal for this competition? Um, we take them daily over teeter-totters for walks and over jumps, and we, we sometimes stick towels on their backs and walk them around. Just to make sure that they'll be behaved? Yeah. Okay. Well, good luck to both of you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So this one looks friendly. He likes now, to give kisses. Now, has he competed yet? Yes. How'd he do? He's got first, third, and fifth. And then we haven't competed in this one yet. Okay. And this one is how well behaved he is, right? Um, this determines what he can and can't do, what he's willing to do. Mm -hmm. um, he's been worked by two other people, so he's been in six different shows today. Mm -hmm. Wow. So he's starting to get a little antsy with everybody around. I see. And the alpacas have very nice, high-quality wool. What do you make out of the wool? Um, well, it, we make socks out of it, and we make sweaters, and we make yarn. And up there, we also have a pillow that was made out of their fiber. And it's more comfortable than wool, right? It doesn't itch as much, right? Once you wash it the first time, it doesn't itch as much. It's a whole lot warmer, too. Gotcha. Good. this one to be judged? Yes, and how old is this animal? He is three years old. Three? Three years old. Okay, beautiful. Well, good luck to you. Thank you. you can say, they have to demonstrate how well behaved the animals are. So they put them through various tests.
They're going to actually have it go inside the trailer also as one of the tests. So various tests here to see how well behaved the animals are. Absolutely. And here we got another beauty. Was this one judged yet? Another class? He'll be judged to get later? Uh -huh. Okay, well, good luck to you. Uh -huh. <laughs> you all did a really great job with the intermediate and senior PR. And the top five finishers in fifth place showing all star Kristen Buker. <laughs> in fourth place showing Bo Cephas, Ashley Sawyer. calculating here. We're going to figure out who the winners are. Here are the owners of the alpacas. The alpacas have been put away, but they're going And these will be the last two to be judged here, and then we'll find out who the winner is. It's a video clip. Mm -hmm. Is this a she or a he? A he. He seems very well behaved. Yep. So hopefully he'll do good. Okay, we'll see. Doesn't like to walk, though? Yeah, he's good with everything else, though. Okay, well, we'll see then. We'll be watching. I'm going to give out the ribbons right now. Here's the last alpaca in the competition. Doesn't like to walk. He said that. down the stairs nicely. Why is he smaller than the other ones? Um, maybe not enough nutrition, and he's a baby too. But how, so how old is he? Um, 11 months. 11 oh. months, okay. You all getting ready to show this one again? Shoes. And what are you showing it for this time? PR. PR, okay. And how old is he? Five years old. Okay. Good luck. Come on, Bob. Now watch. Here you watch. Good luck. Go ahead. I'm just filming you. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Okay, here we have another winner. Now this one you said won in the costume. Yes. And what place did he win? I believe he placed fourth. Fourth, okay, in costume. Wow, beautiful. And, and how old is he? He's almost four years old. Almost four? Okay, well congratulations. All right, we're here at the fair. You just got here and it's yep. Saturday. I guess they're open until midnight. Are you gonna stay the whole time? Um, yeah, I guess so. What are you if, planning on doing? We'll just hit a little bit of everything. <laughs> All right, get going. Thank you. Take care. Bye -bye. Okay, we got another winner here. And, and what's his name again? Lloyd. Lloyd. Lloyd? Okay. And what did he win this time? He won third place in public relations class. Okay, and I see a bunch of ribbons here. Did he win another w ribbon in a different class? Fourth place in was it obstacle. Obstacle. Okay. Yep. Well, congratulations. Thank Doing you. a good job here at the fair. Okay, and, and what's the, what it, what's its name? His name is Spade. Okay, and now what exactly did you win? Um, I won champion in the junior obstacles. Wow, field. champion. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful animal. And we're going to take a picture also.